Hi guys, this is Edmo and we are back playing Hearts of Iron 4 as Soviet Union. Uh, between episodes I took one more look at this Air Force uh, situation, Air War situation in China. And while we definitely are losing on par with them, it seems like it's partially because we are losing using a lot of old equipment. So I guess we'll need to uh, start once again producing more uh more fighters uh probably even more than investing now so let's uh give that uh well just one more one uh, full line since we got pretty much complacent in that department because they uh, they, they haven't been using a lot of air force against us in germany but well, if even China can't contest that, that's, that's really bad. Also, uh, interestingly enough, if you look at it, uh, it's right here, it seems like we're actually losing basically as much as Chinese in terms of men. Sure, we are pushing and uh, grabbing land, but this is uh, costly. We basically lost as much uh, here as we lost uh, in uh, the whole defensive war against Germany, so... I can only imagine our losses once we uh, go on the offensive here. This is not going to be nice. Uh, Alright, so we, ha we have been pushed. Let's use that to, that to establish a bloody front line finally. Uh, well, we'll see how that goes. If they attack, we'll try to uh, pull back to Copenhagen and uh, continue our defense there, and then, uh, as I mentioned, uh, escaped to Scania. Okay, uh, this is mostly self-sustained. Mm, one more look, okay, for a second I thought there were those uh, black tank divisions here, but not the case. Uh, here we are being attacked, oh, well, just duke it out, I guess. Mm. Right, this is more important. We need this bloody port, and I think we need to start uh, requesting terrain from Mongolia. Well, uh, to, once we get the port, we'll do that. Uh, since uh, not sure if uh, if we'll be in the Allied territory, if the use of ports will be will be sufficient, uh, will work properly. Uh, okay, let's throw more in here. Mm. Okay, I think it's, you guys can shorten this whole thing just a little bit. Uh, you guys are on the defensive. How about you continue here? We need to start quashing this packet uh, to best of our abilities. They do not... Well, we don't need to hurry actually since, well, as you can see they have no ports left. Assuming they won't manage to, to get uh, Liao Tang from Japanese, no. Uh, South Korean one here. Uh, it's Dalian, alright. And this one is uh, Busan, of course. Mm. Now, now, now. Uh, do we want to, to widen the gap here or do we want to push towards mainland China? I'm pretty sure we do want to push towards mainland China. Let's, okay, let's kill that, but that's about it. Uh, 10 divisions here, along with 14 uh, yellow ones. Yeah, that seems enough. Let's uh, grab the blue, uh, not blue, red thing. Uh, make an order. Another order we actually need to, to make. Yeah, alright, and. I'd say we want to uh, activate it outright. I guess to continue this one in a sec. Uh, perhaps we'll widen it a little bit. Uh, huh. Or we can actually remove those yellow divisions and send them here instead of our cavalry. Yeah, I think we'll do that and. Uh, Okay, maybe not. Okay, because if uh, I for a second I wanted to 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 merge those two fronts, but mm. that would 
trigger a massive reorganization and a, a massive waste of time and attrition when they will be will be moving around fairly pointlessly. So now we need to focus on uh, uh, pushing uh, here towards Beijing and uh, into the um, main area of China. Uh, Sadly, we can't use words uh, Japan would use that is uh, naval landing because, well, we don't have a navy to, to, to contest anything uh, here. Well, we could, I guess, contest Chinese, China, yeah, okay. We, we would be able to contest China, but definitely cannot do anything about uh, Japan just yet and probably for another, uh, uh, at least a year. Uh, two, three years, most likely in game. Especially since we uh, aren't really building any uh, anything. Uh, okay, let's try to push through here. I know it's uh, tanks into mountains. Oh man, it's extremely hard to do. Interesting. In the mountain. Um, wonder how much they have in Beijing. As soon as this attack finishes. We'll try to push for Beijing. And frankly, okay, how much do you guys have there? Quite a lot. Um, but let's still cancel one of those and send you here. That will be much easier if we manage to, 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 to cross the river here. Uh, you guys are there. Uh, how about not? Let's uh, reassign you to this this line and continue. You are also there. Let's reassign you here and continue this way. All right. Uh, we have ten divisions. Not sure about those ten divisions there. Let's see about that. Uh, I know what. I how many divisions we have? What? Uh, there's how many? Uh, 11 divisions, so we have 13 here. And, uh, alright, there is, uh, there's an arrow for it, uh, let's, I guess, extend it. I don't want all of you there. Yeah, let's actually cut down on that and uh, reassign them here. Um, uh, Okay, so we managed to cross the river here. Well, it's just a good start, I guess. Uh, well, this seems problematic, but uh, let's send those units through here and this unit through here. That should do it. Uh, let's advance here using this beachhead. At the same time, I think we can uh, tie them down with those units here. Uh, to prevent reinforcements. Uh, won't be as effective as attack from here, but uh, well, here we are being attacked ourselves. Um, no. Well, this is a terrible uh, spot to use those bloody tanks in. That being said, let's actually send a few more tanks in here since we seem to be uh, winning this one out anyway. So extending this front line just a little bit may actually uh, tip the balance and then we would be in a bit better terrain. And it's, it's just those bloody mountains where communist uh, China spawns. And here those are mostly uh, plains where our tanks will be able to, to, to roam freely. So, uh, speaking of roaming freely, let's uh, redeploy here. And uh, also advancing here, trying to continue uh, to, to encircle uh, to some extent Beijing. And if we punch through here, that would be extremely useful. Let's grab uh, some of the. Okay, you are actually moving here. So if we punch through here, we can. Uh, uh, would have a chance of closing this uh, packet and actually start removing some of the uh, Chinese forces from the map because uh, mostly they are in a pretty decent shape as you can see like some of them are, have uh, a bit lower strength but uh, uh, 
at large they are they are in a decent one really. Okay, so this has got kind of split. Uh, all right, so little, little little fix here. So let's delete this and let's delete this and let's make one more a a single uh, line of attack here, like that. Twenty divisions there, and that that's correct. And activate it. All right, they should and do as they. They should do as they should. <laughs> very, very, very much English. Um, well, this attack isn't very, really working. Those attacks here that I ordered earlier also proved problematic. Uh, let's keep those tidy. Uh, okay, seems like we managed to push through here and with. Uh, Help from there, we should be able to do the same here. Uh, yeah, that this should be a, a fairly easy advance. I'm surprised they have like seven divisions here, so uh, that will be pro maybe not a like hundred, but I think like 50 70 divisions here. Uh, we will, uh, that's about the amount we'll be able to catch. and. How many divisions do you guys even have? Alright, so around, around 300. And all of your divisions are actually uh, given to uh, Nationalist China. Okay, let's focus on this. Okay, we managed to, 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 to push through here. And this three divisions here. Uh, five more divisions. Uh, just Just go here. Alright, you can't because this is another attack, but yeah. Okay, now we can. Just overwhelming force. And... Uh, okay, so we'll be able to, 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 to get a packet here, that's nice. Of course that will create a mess. But I'm a bit worried about packets with those red divisions because they will be... Oh, never mind, those are actually properly assigned here. Never mind. <laughs> I, uh, I thought that was uh, one of the packets that got uh, messed up and they got assigned to, the, to, to, to one of those runs here, for example. Uh, no attack here, interestingly enough. How about we attack? Uh, how would that go? Uh, What I wonder is, are we assigned to a front line? It seems like we are, even though it's not showing properly, but uh, if we weren't assigned to a front line, we would have those uh, red exclamation marks. So. Uh, okay, let's do that. Yeah. That's better. It would be much easier to defend, of course, through the, with uh, planning bonus and uh, through the straits. That attack was oddly easy, not, not sure what, what was about that, but because we definitely haven't uh, like actively beaten them back. Ah, now, uh, this is basically... We have no units here. Uh, like that's <laughs> the, the, the cover one are kind of pointless. We have just a little bit here. So most of our forces are uh, here. Huh. I think what we are going to do is... Uh, uh, we have what, 11, divi 11 yellow divisions here. And I mean, those attacks are kind of pointless. Are we really going there? That's, that's that's preposterous. Okay, come here. Yeah, that's enough to the uh, tank division. Uh, okay, let's make sure that like 
no stupid things are happening. Okay, so this is a stupid thing. It's supposed to be here as well. And uh, yeah, we'll pull back all those red divisions from here and uh, assign them here. Going to crush, okay. All of you, uh, except you, will be also assigned here. Uh, right after you deal with this nonsense. Making sure no one just goes into some weird direction. Okay, let's cancel this whole thing. Uh, so here we'll just defend uh, using our yellow divisions and uh, the, the red ones will uh, close this packet uh, from the east. Uh, that should uh, allow us to, 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 to for an easier uh, push into mainland China uh, as soon as our tanks arrive. Okay, maybe, maybe that will help. Uh, okay. Research City Experiment, that if I remember correctly, yes, it gives us a um, boost to uh, nuclear technology. We'll continue for rocketry to finally get a bloody research slot. Um, well, that would be really nice to finally get this. Uh, where are those uh, tank? Did it? Oh, I think they were reassigned. Here, damn it. Alright, let's get the best out of it, I guess. Let's try to. Damn it. it it's, it's all about the, the bloody supply, isn't it? Mm. Well, at least this, those parts are a bit better supplied, so we should be able to finally put our most of our might to bear. Mm. I think I will remove those yellow divisions from here too. It's kind of pointless. Uh, all of you I should basically be assigned there. Mm. Alright, uh, this is their attack. We managed to, to, to walk through here. Alright, so you should try to. Uh, try to go here. Mm, something like that. Oh, right, we captured Beijing. That's. I haven't even noticed, but yeah, they, they weren't defending it too heavily. Uh, Alright, yeah, that works. It will actually, of course, mess this whole thing up uh, shortly, but yeah. But we will be in a good situation that I think like cutting off like almost 20 divisions there, definitely worth a little reorganization. Uh, of course to that to do that to that end we need to uh, actually get uh, the port or they will simply will swim out of there or possibly getting killed by the Japanese Navy but still. Leon Trotsky questions the motives of Iran. Right, uh, how far are we? Uh, oh, 40 days. Uh, soon we'll need to uh, start sending units there. Mm. I think we'll need to get to some of our tanks from here because it's, we aren't really using them properly anyway. Sure, they will be much more useful in this terrain, but still, I think um, half of what we are using here will be um, sufficient. Okay, uh, let's continue. Oh, this is actually getting pretty fast. This whole this whole attack here. Uh, just support this attack and. Uh, yeah, just deal with it. Uh, this will probably last for a while. Making sure that all of this is being taken care of. Uh, mm, 
I don't think there are problems with supplies, not r not really. I saw some minuscule ones, but nothing to write home about, so... Very good. What's weird is that this whole area is un... Uh, not represented enough. Uh, right, because our front line is a bit messed up again. Let's actually break them on this river. That will once again trigger a reorganization, but... Uh, like, I, I will just leave this mostly for AI to, 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 to cover. Uh, speaking of AI, let's uh, do this. Uh, let's just, let's just uh, put them into the defensive positions for the time being. And you guys should be assigned. Okay, you are assigned there, you just can't go there because you are... Uh, well, it, there is not enough supply, so let's, you know, just a small push here. Grab a handful of provinces, and here. Same goes for those tanks. Mm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Maybe we should push for a victory point there? Eh, probably not. Let's Problem is we can't really take those tanks from here uh, because we don't have uh, enough troops to to, uh, to defend it. Okay, let's reassign some of those here because I don't know the, the, they aren't really good at of, uh, at offense anyway. So let's reassign them there. Uh, let's remove this whole thing uh, like that. Uh, this one I will reassign in a sec. Like I want our proper infantry to 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 to, to work this whole thing. Uh, actually, let's let's do it like this already. Uh, I should probably remove the front line for for tanks altogether, but that's uh, that's in a sec. Uh, okay, that I see ten divisions there. So why why not use that? Uh, uh, we are going here, here, and here. Here we go. And yeah, this is a fairly safe part of the front. And no aggression back from the trash. No, sorry. All right, so we managed to secure a port. Is this port here anyway? Pretty sure it is. Oh, Jesus! This is naval base two. Uh, Okay, <laughs> not as impressive as I hoped. Yeah, we st we are still better off being supplied for land. Oh well. Mm, mm, right. You know what? Let's put a front line here for the time being. Till I have something for you to do. Let's get the the bonus here. Oh, in bad supply. Huh. You know what? Uh, we'll leave the, the the red guys here, but all of you will actually go to to deal with Iran. Uh, I mean, we'll leave the the black guys here, and but those those units will be sent to Iran, which is a terrible thing thing to do because Iran is mostly mountains, but. Uh, yeah, so, but, uh, now uh, you know what, let's, let's leave them here and we'll use them in, them around here and we'll send all those yellow divisions to run. Yeah, that's better. Sorry for flip flopping about it, but yeah, this, like, problem with supplies is fairly infuriating. I wish we had the, the, the option to uh, research next level of a maintenance, com not maintenance company, logistics company. Oh, that's one of the most important things we'll do next time around. Yeah. Alright, so let's squash this, I guess. And then we'll do a small reorganization. Can we? So, uh, okay, definitely don't want... Okay, let's put half of you 
Yeah. Very nice. And... Make sure this dies. And then we can... Uh, okay, first of all, let's reassign all of you, all of you here, actually. Uh, here you go. And uh, still, all of you, even if you are not assigned to those things, make sure this whole thing dies. Okay, now, now that's better. Uh, we have a decent-ish front line. And uh, I think we'll make it a bit bigger. Uh, we'll start rolling back those uh, 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 those mountain troops from here. Eight divisions. Uh, let's actually cut it to four, shall we? And send them here for a time being, and soon we will send them to China. Uh, to Iran. Uh, but, uh, since you should, uh, uh, wow, this is a pretty bad attrition, isn't it? Uh, let's actually do a little micromanagement and make them uh, redeploy rather than move. Okay, uh, where do you want to move? You want to move there. There you go. I. I said that uh, ten times already, but I really preferred when they were uh, strategic redeployment happy, uh, happy uh, in one of the earliest builds. Uh, sure, they were redeploying like the two provinces on the front line, but that was easier to manage than uh, them walking through ten provinces of, of mountains and never being able to catch up on foot like this, for example. This is this is a like. How long will it take them to get there? Two weeks. So, and here the, the front line is is long gone, and yet you will you, uh, spend uh, almost a week to move there. Yeah, uh, you know, like all, all those things. You can see here. Uh, Okay, I want some of more units around here. Uh, that's one more check on uh, Air Force. So we... Uh, we lost quite a lot, as you can see, but... Uh, let's assume that those were mostly all old fighters, that you can see here. Uh, still only one airfield, is it? Uh, Remember correctly, the airfield is just somewhere around here uh, for Manchuria, if there is any, really. I don't, I'm not 100% sure. And here, the air, I think one of the airfields is somewhere around here. Or maybe I'm remembering it from Hus Final 3. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, okay, let's continue. But this is like a this already a fairly decent situation, and uh, uh, as soon as this whole thing dies, I think we will be in a really nice position to to start a proper push into um, a mainland China or into a heart of China. Let's call it. Uh, okay, and those ten divisions are sitting there to die. I'm not complaining. Hmm. And we should probably limit this. We don't want to basically... Sure, we can survive attacking for hills, but that's about it. Uh, how are we doing here? Uh, we've been better. Do we have more divisions? Uh, it's actually... Since we are already here, we might as well start, start pushing. Let's try since there is no... No opposition to speak of. Uh, one of you go and go supported that. All right, so this died. Huh. Um, let's redeploy. Uh, the problem is that some of our the tanks from this this group are still here. Let's run and assign them all of them. Uh, 
I think so. I've been using them uh, like a while ago to uh, plug some gaps in our defense. Well, another f attack there. Uh, uh, uh. Where I want you. I don't want the, the front line just yet. Uh, actually, we do have a front line, so let's cancel it. And so let's all redeploy here. How is the supply here? It's bad. Uh, and even though all of that is not here. Uh, oh man. I don't want to split those because, well, they are fighting quite a lot of the uh, on the western front, front getting experience for this guy, so I will suffer through it. Uh, let's actually send you here. Uh, well, could have sent you there, but yeah. Uh, we'll try to grab with a little bit more terrain using our black, uh, black tanks. And uh, then once this opens up, we'll send another group, I guess. Mm. How is this push going? Uh, well, not really. Like we we surrendered half of this front. Uh, at least this is. Well, it's not going very steady, is it? Uh, how? Bad is your supply problem. Okay, it's almost maxed out, so that should be collapsing fairly shortly. Very nice. Mm. Lastly, let's grab uh, like yeah, that's. We will never be able to 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 put uh, enough uh, infantry divisions here. I'm afraid. So how about we get? Mm, let's say 13 and actually send them to, to Iran. We need some troops there once we declare the war, so might as well use those. And uh, despite the fact that those aren't mountain troops there, will still uh, fare better than our uh, fairly weak uh, mountain ones. Okay, let's continue the line grab. Uh, even though we already encountered some resistance, that would most likely be enough. Uh, let's get to that river, I guess. Uh, okay, and just m moving there. Okay, so okay, we need a bloody spoiling attack here. Here we go. And this attack, okay, maybe not. Maybe not yet. Uh, sit, sit tight. All right. Um, yeah, that's yeah, that's looking good. Uh, uh, let's also make uh, this active. Uh, make them attack whenever they they feel like it. Uh, normal. Well, attack since uh, actually we they are trying to take this back. So let's just stop it. Uh, let's see. Okay, so they will be actively losing organization due to lack of supplies, like in a in an in game week or so. Uh, all right, managed to to manage to finish this off uh, once again. Uh, Preemptively removing all of the units there to, to, to prevent them from messing this whole thing up. And uh, yeah, but that, that I'm not sure it. What is it? Those are fucking mountains. Okay, maybe that won't work. Uh, definitely not through the bloody river too. So that was a st <laughs> stupid idea of an attack. Uh, River into mountains with tanks. Eh? The fuck thinks of something like that. Uh, so you guys should redeploy uh, here somewhere. Oh, look at that! We are going to capture this one. 
Uh, let's make another another cut through here. Uh, oh, this is into what heals, but there are three divisions, and those aren't very weak divisions. Uh, you guys are attacking there. Uh, it's time to actually activate those orders, to be honest. Since well, I'm trying to, 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 to keep this whole thing moving. And for that reason I sometimes have my troops sitting there doing nothing. So might as well uh, make them attack uh, when nothing happens. Uh, ah, damn it. I lost this one, haven't I? Uh, you are supporting this attack, very good. Uh, oh, well. Seems like they managed to reinforce fast enough, but not here at least. Um, let's try to grab this real quick. And this, yeah, so I managed to push fairly deep into, well, the territory uh, Japan gets if uh, China gets scared at Marco Polo Bridge. And I think that's enough for today. We'll continue in the next episode, and so by then I think we'll go to war against Iran. Uh, oh, seems like it won't actually get us into war with allies, but to that end I think we'll just start uh, justifying on the United States and, well, on or just on the British Raj or something, and uh, get this war going from the get-go. Uh, but what is uh, tempting is to start to declare war on uh, uh, bits of those minor nations just to make them uh, not join actual allies, but rather, for example, the United Chinese Front, which is actually possible that they will do. And what that will, of course, uh, um, the situation that it will create will... Uh, um, well, it is simply once we defeat them and China, uh, we won't uh, have to uh, just sit, uh, use uh, garrison forces to, to, to fight resistance there. Which would be a pain in the ass because, well, it will be a while till we get, for example, conquer United States or something. So that will be a few years of sitting bloody, bloody, sending cavalry to, to like some, some shit in northern Iran or something. So. That's, I'm a bit tempted to, to hold on with a declaration of war against allies, especially since we don't really have a, um, a front line against them just yet anyway. So I think we'll go against Afghanistan and Tibet just to get uh, get actual uh, front line against them. Well, actually, I guess we have front line against them here in Xinjiang. But attacking through Himalaya... Eh. Well, not really Himalaya. Himalaya are like more here, but yeah. Well, this is... I'm pretty sure that's the, the part of Himalaya, isn't it? Isn't Kashmir like... I kind of thought that Kashmir is a bit down to the south. Not... Okay, maybe I'm... maybe I'm talking out... No, um, okay. It's an old map, like India and... Uh, Alright, yeah. This is... Uh, here is uh, Pakistan and what about. Yeah, okay, I'm not going to... <laughs> talk in geographical nonsense anymore. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I will see you in the next episode. Cheers.